And it is Friday, and we are back with the Fox Carolina Tailgate Tour. It's week nine, I can't believe that, of our tour. We're getting ready for that big game doorman taking on Gaffney. We have our whole crew out there. We have sports director Beth Hool. We have chief meteorologist Kendra Kent. And uh, they're taking in all that sunshine on that football field. That's right. They join us now with much more oh. on the field. And, uh, yeah, Kendra, <laughs> just, just soak it in. So let's go and start with you in the Friday <laughs> night forecast. Love it. Oh, it's so nice. Only problem is it's like in that, you know, that spot where it's just right in your eyes, but yes. nice though. Yes. No, it's a beautiful, nice, warm sun. Mm -hmm. Exactly. It's just absolutely perfect. And you know, it's going to hit just that little crisp feeling in the air, which is just yeah. perfect. It means college or high school football. It really does. All kinds of football All for kinds sure. Of football, yes. And if you're coming out to the game, just, you know, it may feel good to you now, but as we go into the later hours, it's going to get pretty chilly. Uh, let's take a look at current temperatures out there. It's been fairly mild for the most part, uh, but for your tailgate tour forecast, it's going to be in the mid fifties uh, as we get to kickoff and then we'll be tra trailing on into the forties during the second half at around 50 um, at halftime. So you'll likely want that that light jacket, maybe a little blanket over you over the stands. I think it'll feel, feel good to the players, though. And then going into the overnight, temperatures will cool down into the 30s in many spots in the upstate. Again, you may find some frost outside your window in the mountains in the mid 30s expected. So it'll still be very chilly early on, but an absolutely beautiful weekend on the way. We're talking upper 60s to low 70s uh, for all of the festivities. Maybe you're taking the kids to boo in the zoo. Maybe you're going to the Clemson or Carolina game. Weather is going to cooperate just just right for all of that. And I think the weather is going to be pretty good for the folks out here and the players. You guys probably prefer it to be a little bit cooler outside. Now, I want to introduce all of you guys. We've got Caliber. He's the safety for Gaffney. And then we've got Edward Jeffries, and you are the wide receiver. And we've got Grayson Loftus, our quarterback. And we're so glad to have you guys here. What's it like going into such a big game? Are the nerves there? You just pumped and excited. Oh, uh, yes, ma'am. Um, it's a lot of, it's a lot of, uh, nerve, nerve wracking. Absolutely. Um, my, my nerves are up here right now, but I'm going to go out and play play I mean, my best game. That means you want to go really yes, kill it tonight. Yes, <laughs> well, and you know, you guys had that. We were here just a couple of weeks ago when you guys were hosting Spartanburg. That was a thrilling game where you guys won in overtime. How has that game helped advance your confidence um, and moving in? And as you guys prepare, you're playing for a region championship tonight. You know, I think it was just getting off from, in region play on the right foot. Um, you were able to get out of week, week one in region with a win. Um, and win the following week. So now, you know, like you said, rolling into this week, playing for a region championship. You guys have played well against Dorman the last couple of years. You've had their number. What's it take? What's this game really like to prepare for? Um, just hard work and practice. And Dorman, a very good team. We're just coming to play hard and hopefully win the game. Hopefully win the game. I want to hear a little bit more confidence from you. Oh, sure. <laughs> win the game. There we yes. go. Yes, absolutely. And well, that's Suge. We got to get the nicknames out there because that's what everybody knows you as, as Gappy. What's it like throwing to this young man? Uh, it's a lot of fun. Um, you know, <laughs> we've developed the connection pretty pretty quickly last year when I got here um, and, it, and it paid off last year in Columbia win, to win a state championship and this year it's just, you know, continuing to grow. That's well, and, and as seniors, this has got to mean a lot. Uh, you know, that's and it just takes it to another level. How much would a win mean tonight? <laughs> A win would be very good for us tonight. Absolutely. Confident. Yeah, How about you? What do you think? Um, it would be great for us to get this win so we don't got to worry about Burns next week. So maybe we could get some rest, get some mm -hmm. recovery time. So it'll be it'll be a huge win for Your us. Your offensive coordinator was hoping for more rest, but he came yes. out and joined <laughs> us earlier. So You know, it's funny. We're, sure, you're so quiet and reserved, but I know we're going to have some highlights from you tonight explosive. when we have these. Yes, yeah, some explosive <laughs> highlights, guys. We'll have those for you tonight on the 10 o'clock news as well as at 11 on our Fox Carolina tailgate.